How to connect Windows Virtual PC to the network. Here's how. 1. Open the created or XP mode virtual machine in Windows Virtual PC that you want to connect to the network. 2. On the Virtual Machines menu bar, click on Tools. A. If you see Disable Integration Features, then go to Step 5. B. If you see Install Integration Features, then go to Step 3. C. If you see Enable Integration Features, then go to Step 4. 3. To install integration features in Windows Virtual PC. A. Click on Install Integration Components. B. Follow steps 15 to 20 here. Click on Link to finish installing. C. When finished, continue on to step 4. 4. To enable integration features in Windows Virtual PC. A. Click on Enable Integration Components. B. Log on using the username and password for the virtual machine. Note. If you do not see the username for you virtual machine, then click on Use Another Account to enter the username and password and click on OK. C. When finished, continue on to Step 5. 5. To enable Virtual PC Network Filter Driver in Windows 7. Note, this step is to be done in your host Windows 7 computer and not in the virtual machine in Windows. Virtual PC. A. Open the Control Panel, Icons View, then click on the Network and Sharing Center icon. B. In the Network and Sharing Center. Click on the Change Adapter Settings link on the left side. C. Right-click on your Internet Network Connection, and click on Properties. Note. Make note of the network adapter name, X, Marvel Yukon. You will need to know this in Step 7b below. D. If prompted by UAC, then click on Yes. E. If not already, check the Virtual PC Network Filter Driver box, and click on OK. F. Close the Network Connections window. 6. If you use a router with MAC address filtering enabled. Note Note. If you do not, then skip this step and go to Step 7 instead. If you do. Then this step will show you how to get the MAC address of the virtual machine in Windows Virtual PC so you can add it to the MAC filtering rules of your router to allow the virtual machine access through the router. A. In the virtual machine, open a command prompt and type ip config all space after g and press enter. B. In the command prompt, look for the MAC address x. O O O three F F one E O three fifty seven to the right of physical address. Write this MAC address number down. C in your Windows seven computer, not virtual machine. Open your web browser X Internet Explorer and log in to your router. Note. You would usually do this by typing in your router's IP address in the web browser's address bar, and pressing Enter. Consult your router's manual to see what its default IP address is. D. Go to your router's network filter settings, and add the virtual machine's MAC address, Step 6B, to the MAC filtering rules and save it. Note, this is for AD Link Router but this will vary depending on what brand and model of router you have. Consult your router's manual on how to enter the MAC address. E. You can now close the web browser in your Windows 7 computer, not virtual machine. F. Close the command prompt in the virtual machine. G. 
Continue on to step 7. 7. To set the virtual machine network settings. A. On the virtual machines menu bar, click on tools and settings. B. In the left pane, select networking, then select your network adapter name. Step 5. See above. From the drop down box and click on OK. Note. If you have more than one network adapter available and you do not know which one to select, then test using each one until you have a connection. C. Continue on to step 8. 8. Select the network location type you want for the virtual machine to have the settings for that. Location automatically applied. 9. The virtual machine in Windows Virtual PC should now be able to connect to your network and access the Internet from it. That's it. Sean.